Hey guys, this is Douglas. Um, not a bad day today. Uh, as the title says, I'm gonna show you eight home workouts using furniture and kitchen stuff to make your training more efficient and more enjoyable because there are people out there that do not have any proper weights nor resistant band at home. So without further ado, let's move on to the eight unique exercises that nobody teaches on the planet. Let's go. Number one, move bed floor press. So this is the furniture variation of the barbell floor press, which is a great approach to target your triceps, shoulders and chest. Moreover, the roof bed floor press is much safer than both barbell floor press and the barbell bench press because there are contact points at the rear end of the bed to help you secure your pressing trajectory, just like a Smith machine, which will reduce the rate of you screwing up. Next, Ironman Quantum Bars Ladder Race. Inspired by Ironman, the Quantum Bars Ladder Race is just like your regular dumbbell ladder race. However, your arms are held much more stable inside the vase, which will result in a much better isolation of the lateral delts, aka your side shoulders. The lateral delts are one of the most important small muscle groups in your body because it defines the overall shapes of your shoulders. Try this for a month and you will probably not use dumbbells again. Next, Newton's Third Law will drop lat roll. Inspired by Newton's Third Law of Motion, and although this exercise has little to do with the actual principles and equations, it is however a remarkable exercise on both hypertrophy and muscular endurance of your lats if you do not have any carryable weights at home including the resistance band. The tension on the pull is derived from the push of your feet. The more you kick, the heavier the pull gets. 15 reps of this are enough to get your lats and biceps on fire. Next, Asian Mom's Frying Pan Chest Group. Nothing is more majestic than the frying pan owned by an Asian mom. The design of the pan from the handle to the pan itself gives you an excellent sensation while performing the chair scoops. Even though the origin of this exercise can be traced back to the cable machine, the frying pan chair scoop, in my opinion, triumphed the cables. Next, rice cooker kettle swing. Derived from the kettlebell swing, the rice cooker kettle swing, however, will actually serve you better in the swing due to its bigger mass which is easier to handle and feel the momentum of the swing. You don't need kettlebells. This is the best way to improve your aerobic capacity, increase the rate of force development and rapid muscle activation in your glutes and hamstrings at home. Next, Super Bowl Olympic Fly. Even though the Olympic Fly is originated from Chinese Olympic weightlifting to improve shoulder mobility and trap strength, if you reduce the weight to a pair of bowls, it becomes one of the best exercises to train both muscular endurance of your shoulders and traps simultaneously due to the ultra long range of motion. Don't believe it? Try it! Next, Arm Extended Table Plank. This is actually derived from one of the gymnastic movements and is meant to demolish, I mean strengthen your core and lower back. Because the contact points are extended away from you, it makes this exercise 100 times more difficult than a regular elbow plank. If you got bored from doing elbow plank, try the arm extended version. Next, mansion up pull ups. Alright, uh, mansion is a type of house in Singapore which typically has two floors. If you live in a mansion, there's no need for you to buy any home pull up bar that sleeps all the time. All you need to do is to jump to the second floor, hang yourself on the second floor, and pull your ass up. Genius. Alright, enough of all the descriptions on the exercises. Let's turn it into a proper home program to make all this work. We can start with a superset on the pose between mentioned pull-ups and wood drop lat row. I would love to have 4 sets of 6 reps on the pull-ups with a tempo of 2010 and 4 sets of 15 reps per side on the wood drop lat row at a tempo of 3010. As mentioned before, tempo is the pace. 3 second eccentric and 1 second concentric. We can move on to a superset on the press. We can group the wood bed floor press and frying pan chest group into supersetting. 4 sets of 15 reps for the bed and 4 sets of 20 reps per side for the pen, both at a tempo of 3010. And then we can move on to smaller muscle groups like shoulders. We can put Super Bowl Olympic Fly and Quantum Vast Lateral Race into super setting. 4 sets of 15 reps on the bow with a tempo of 4020 and 4 sets of 12 reps per side on the vast with a tempo of 3010. After that, we can move on to some core accessories on arm extended table plank, 15 to 20 seconds for 3 sets. 
lastly, we can end with some aerobic endurance and that will be the rice cooker kettle swing. 20 to 30 reps for 4 sets and done. Uh, that was pretty intense. Uh, my mom got mad at me for using a cooker and pen. Anyway, thanks for watching and feel free to try it. I think you can find most of the stuff in your house. Um, and see you next time. Bye.